Hey all, I'm Samriddhi and I'm Ria. So today we're going to be showing you some addition tricks. Yeah. So um, Ria is going to be giving me a few sums and I'm going to be writing. So first one is a very simple one. Let's just say. Plus two. So the first one third is going to be so five. This is for smaller kids like first one. Yeah. So one, two, three, four, and five. Five plus two and five, and then this one is two, right? So well, now this two is a little confusing, right? So all you have to do is just add it in. Okay, so I will be adding it up. So one, two. So now one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. The answer is definitely going to be seven. Simple. So this is prob, and then you could do it in another way, which is by using you know, using your hands. So five plus two. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Simple. Both the ways are pretty easy to understand and do it, and especially first time kids can use it. Yeah. Hmm. One small trick I'm going to just show you. It's not an addition trick, but it's just a counting trick. If you only have ten fingers, right? You just keep on counting. That's too much. So instead, what I do, like we have these lines on our fingers, right? So I do one, two, three, four. It's just easy because in one hand you get so many numbers. Yeah. That's just I do. Like just how I do. Yeah, you could do it in the way I showed you, or you could do it the way you know we are showed. You. No, that way is for the addition, but it's like normally just for counting. And yeah. Okay, fine. So, um, second trick I'm going to be showing you, like not a trick, but it's for checking if your answer is correct. Hmm. So I just give a simple number like twenty-two plus eleven. Hmm. So this is a pretty easy one. Even this is also easy, but this is a verification one. So you've got to do the verification on the side. That's why she, you know, you write this on the, on the page. So you could draw a line on your page, and you can do this. So two plus one is three, right? One. So two plus three. I mean two. Plus one is three. One second. Okay, and then this is also three. So to verify this, if we got it right, we could do it this way. So there are two ways of verifying it actually. That is, so thirty-three is the answer what we've gotten minus eleven. So whatever your answer comes, so three minus one is. Two and the other three minus two is so this answer comes over here, right? Correct. Or you could do this one like thirty-three minus twenty-two, which is going to be eleven, and it comes over here. So you can do either thing, like, but you have to like do this minus one of these numbers. It's your yeah, choice. Yeah, it's your choice. So like, if you do this minus this, it has to come this. If you do this minus this, it has to come this. Yeah. That's the verification one. Now we're doing another number. Yeah, this is for the gap of ten. Okay, so let's say thirty-two plus ten. Hmm. So this is actually, uh, you know, I'm going to be showing you a. Trick in it, so that is, you can just pull a uh, if there's a, if there's a zero in here, okay, or if there's any number here, so like it, let it be two, three, four, five, anything until nine, it's gonna be easy. And yeah. anything it has to be everything in like the ten table. It should be ending with zero. Yeah, uh, ending with a zero, it's gonna be easy for you only. So the thing is, all you should do is drag down the upper number, whatever it is. So this is two, so I'm gonna drag down two. Straight. Then this one. So you don't have to do anything. Just look at the number here and here. So here it's given one. Okay. So here I just uh you know after three what number comes? 
you all know it comes four. So all you have to do is write down the number which comes after it. And this is how you do it. So let it be any number over here. Let's let it be two. Okay. So even here you have to only add two in this. So like this. So after three, four, five. So five, right? So fifty-two. So anything ending with zero, you just have to write in the number and then just keep adding in this. So if it's one, it's gonna be the easiest. So let me show you one more thing about this. So even if even if it's like a huge number, let's say um, like let's just say two, three, two plus one zero zero. All you have to do is zeros, right? So you just need to bring down the two and bring down the three. Yeah, so three, three, two because you have to just find the number after this. Yeah, so in anything, so let it be even like you know any number. So over here there's a zero. All you have to do is drag down the upper number to the down answer place. That's a very simple thing. Everyone can you know do it. Yeah. Hmm. So well, that was the video for addition tricks and. Um, well, you, if you think that this one is like for very smaller kids, we'll soon have a video which is also for like 5th or 6th. Okay, guys, this future is like a big comment. We realize that we give a big share in the video description and video in So, like, what we did is then we just put the picture thing in the school, the file is just in the book, and then we can take a couple of times in our main to see the next one. 6th graders. Like yeah. we'll show like bits for actually higher grades. This is for like first and second graders. Yeah, this is actually to make it easy for you know uh, for the smaller kindergarten kids. You know? Yeah, even bigger kids can use it. Like until third, but like in fifth standard, we have much bigger numbers. Yeah, and fifth standard it goes all the way to lakhs, thousands. Kind yeah, of so we'll be showing more tricks at that time. Yeah, we'll be show, uh, we'll be coming and with the tricks. Uh, you know, by the end of the year, you other uh, by two months you'll be getting the video. Yeah, two. Three. And one more additional trick I just wanted to show you guys. Like this trick, like just the continuation of this. Let's just see again two, three, two, and five plus one, zero, zero. See, now somebody is there anyway you can use a trick in this? Yeah, we can but except not for the thousands and the tons place. You can only use it for the hundreds and the tens place. So it goes like this. So two and three and then three here again and then this comes into eight. So this is how I mean sorry. So this is how you're gonna do it. Yeah guys. So if you can't see the numbers you just written down. Three, three, two, two and, and eight. eight. Yep. These are the numbers. So thank you. So we'll be posting almost like most of our study videos on this channel. Study with Samruti and Ria. Well, we posted this here because you guys don't know about the channel, right? So like yeah, this is the only video we are going to be posting here. The other videos about relating to study, you can go check it out on this channel if you. You know, need any multiplication or any sort of anything, like anything yeah. in math. Any subject, like it could be. We yeah, most maths, English, and everything. Hindi, Kannada, and all. Okay, so this is our plan about what we're going to be posting. So week one, we're going to be posting math. Week two, we are going to be posting Hindi. And week three, we're going to be posting Kannada. And week four, we will be posting. English, and there are gonna be some extra videos which are gonna come every month. Like one of those extra videos every month. The topics are GK, social science, social studies, science, and self-realization activity. Bye, Bye everyone.